and my man just hopped on the screen. Jason Thomas, how you doing, sir? Come off mute for me. Hey, I'm doing better than amazing, sir. Better than amazing. I like to hear it. Jason. So, Jason, you uh, uh, still in the military, as we can we can uh, tell. <laughs> What's your rank? Hey, CW2, 19 years in. I'll be hitting that 20-year anniversary here in June. Talk to me, Jason. What's your story? Hey, so I appreciate it. I know you've been killing this uh, <laughs> this overview. I heard a few of the testimonies. So shout out to Taryn and Cherie on uh, kickstarting this launch party. And with that fabulous testimony of $600 uh, already back into his paycheck. And then Fatima with her amazing testimony from earlier. I know she's killing it and uh, sharing this wealth all throughout North Carolina. So with me, uh, my story is pretty much very similar, Charles. You know, I got with the experts, uh, uploaded my last two pay stubs and uh, my last year's tax return, and they instantly got me back a $2,400 salary increase. Uh, that looks like $200 a month for those that didn't do the math. That's $200 a month. And uh, for some, Charles, that, that, that may not look like a lot or seem like a lot, but for me, with six kids, you know, six children, uh, single income, understand that, um, that was enough. That was enough to take me out of a negative cash flow cycle into a positive cash flow cycle. And that's really what I want to hit on because most people don't know the advantage of owning a business. Yeah, everybody can be entrepreneurs, you know, starting things from the ground up. But when you walk into this type of system, that's what a business is, a system to where it's just turnkey and to where now you're able to just by having this business, uh, I've been able to write off, you know, my meals that I eat out. And for anybody to know, I love to eat. So uh, I write off all my meals. Uh, I've been able to write off my mileage. I've been able to write off uh, my electricity, a portion of my mortgage, all of those things compounded. And these past two years, these past two years, I've been over, I've been able to write off over $35,000 of my income. What that looks like on paper is that the, the government taxed me, could only tax me on 18,000 last year, and they only taxed me on 21,000 this past year. What that looks like, Charles, is last year, I was in the 8% tax bracket, you know? This year, <laughs> this year, I was in the 0% tax bracket. <laughs> last year, I got a, you know, it, as a business owner, you just don't wanna have to owe the IRS. But last year, I got $900 back into my household without paying any taxes. This year, I got $6,000 back without paying but only $1,800 in taxes. So each year, I'm getting better and better with these write-offs. I'm, I'm paying less and less taxes, and I'm getting more and more back from the expenses that I turn into deductions. And that right there has been a strategy that I employ everybody to, to, to basically take a part of. Think about this. We have and this has got some military community out there. We have majors, colonels, sergeant majors, first sergeants, sergeant first classes, specialists that are they're, they're in a position to where they're making so much money to where they owe the IRS. Here's a company that shows you how to not only uh, not owe the IRS, but keep all of your money and then get a huge tax rebate <laughs> at the end of the year. What better, what better strategy can you ask for? Oh, by the way, we're going to help you. They help us get our credit scores up. I went from a 644 to the mid 700s. Yes. Oh, they're going to eliminate your debt. Hey, within the first two months with this cash flow positive system and me gaining $20 a day, $600 a month, adding that up with my cash flow. Hey, I was making $800 per month with this company because they started paying me daily checks, monthly checks. Oh my gosh, where can I go? So I got out of debt within the first two months with this company. And oh, by the way, they give us multiplication assets. So now I have a private reserve account growing at double digit returns, something I didn't have with a TSP. And oh, by the way, I can dip into that money when I want to. I don't have to wait till I'm old, crusty and disgusted and can't really do nothing with it. So when you just talk about that a little bit, that's enough. But there is so much more to this organization and this company that we're just we're on the tip of the iceberg, Charles. And uh, Taryn, I'm so happy that you joined this organization. Because when the extra digit movement gets together and we wrap our hands our, and our arms around each other, I tell you, it's better than being downrange. It's better than family. It's, it's, see, I didn't talk to my soldiers about finances like I do with this organization. I definitely didn't talk to my family. When you start talking finances and uh, wealth and strategies with people that you don't even know, 
you have entered a whole new level of uh, friendship, camaraderie, and I would say even discipline because we hold each other accountable. But more importantly, we love to have fun. So, hey, I'm thankful for the opportunity to share that. But, you know, Charles, you've been like a, a financial dad to me, man. I appreciate everything you do. Not only the time that you served in the military, but what you do with extra digit movement, our legacy movement, and the in, in the NWR financial uh, entirety as a whole. We don't really know what we have until we <laughs> until we lose it. And sir, I thank you so much for for continuing the, the pursuit and sharing this information and bringing others in, like Taryn and Cherie, for Tima and myself to let us know on the military side. There was so much stuff that we didn't know, stuff that we don't get taught. And still, even on the on the on the um officer side, it's not even even it's not even heard of. So, sir, I appreciate you continue doing what you're doing. Taryn and Sheree, I know y'all gonna turn it up because there are so many more people out there that need this information. Rather you on the the upside of the scale of finances or you dipping below. Hey, this company has everything we have uh, we need to um to tap into, and everything you we have to offer is is fully accessible to everybody on the Zoom. So. Hey, Charles, I appreciate the opportunity to share my testimony. I look forward to more testimonies, man. I can't wait. I can't wait to game change. Now, now, Jason, I'm going to have to do you like I did for team because <laughs> you 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 talk fast. You're excited. I, 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 can, I can feel your passion. But you just went through some stuff like, like it was nothing to you. Did I hear you say you got taxed off of $18,000 instead of a CW2 pay, what, what should yes, you have been taxed off of? Yeah, I should have been taxed off. See, what's great about the military, we don't get all the extras added in there, but I should have got taxed on about $70,000 in 2020, uh, 20 or uh, 69000 in 2021 and about 72000 this past year. But yet I got taxed at 18000 in 2021 and I got taxed on 21000 in 2000. 22. Yes, yes. See, Jason, you got to slow down when you go to that part. So you just kind of flew by that, you know, because <laughs> that's some big numbers, right? From 72 to 18, that's Yeah, that's you're talking crazy. about a $50,000 savings. You know, when you add in the $35,000 in everyday expenses, like I said, the food, the gas, the repairs, all the stuff we're going to spend on money anyway. That's why I just don't understand why people don't grasp that part. You're going to spend the money anyway. And so since I spent that money anyway, the hotel trips, <laughs> the vacations with the kids, you know, all that stuff, the dog, if you have them, um, $55,000 total with the standard deduction. That's $55,000 that the IRS took away out of my income on paper and said, oh, you only made 18000 You only made 18000 So that's all we can tax you on. It's a huge game changer. That's amazing. Now, you said something else, too, that you kind of flew right by. You say you get an extra $600 per month. See, I just showed the pay scale that went from $5 all the way to $15,000. So basically, you're saying you're at $20 a day. So you got all of that success with less than 30 people on a team because 12 yeah. people get you to $600. Yeah, right. 12 people got me to 600. So you don't need a lot of people to partner with you to have the success that you had. I mean, $50,000, uh, you, you said you got back 200 in taxes, but you got 600 residual coming. That sounds like 800 to me. Yeah. You know, and, and, and so a person with six kids, when they go out to eat, you can write <laughs> off meals. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. See, I don't know if people really caught that, you know, because like I said, you know, you, you was kind of going through it. But that's that's phenomenal, Jason, man. And and I love your energy. I really wanted people to, to hear hear that from you because a lot of people get focused on the the investment. And I say investment because people look at the investment like it's a bill. But that 150 brought you back and here's another thing that you said and i don't know if they really they caught it but i heard you when you said it you got back a nine thousand dollar rebate not a refund because refund yep. is getting your yep. money back again yep see a rebate is when you spend money 
with a company and then they reimburse you some money. So because you didn't pay any taxes, the money that you got as a refund was really a rebate because you never got your own money back. You just, the government just had to reimburse you of expenses that you was using that you was going to spend anyway. Right. Hey Charles, you, you, you hit hitting some points, but I want another point that you, that, that you hit on with the cash flow and the income piece. So when you're talking about, and I know you got these numbers somewhere around in that little portfolio that you got back there, but when you talk about making an extra $600 a month, people, people, I don't think people really know how much you would have to have in the bank to earn $20 a day, $600 a month residually as compared to, um, you know, finding something else to do, like being in real estate. You got all those expenses that you got to pour into on real estate. You know, you got to keep up. You got to have a tenant in order to gain a minimum $200 per house or $600 per condo or something like that. But when you talk about $20 a day, $600 a month, and that's just a, that's just a small step in this comp plan. Charles, how much, do you remember how much you got to have growing at 5% or 8% to, to even make that kind of money? Well, let's do the math. So if you got $600 and we divide that by uh, 0.05%, you got to have $12,000. So that means you have to have $12,000 growing at 5% to earn that $600. Now, what that's saying is because uh, Turin and Fatima got $600 back <laughs> as a pay raise, yeah. as a pay raise, a pay increase. Now, this without putting anybody in the business, this is what I'm telling anybody, just the expert got them an extra $600 a month. That's just like investing 12,000 and letting it grow at 5%. Oh, that's, that's amazing. But, but let, let me, let me do your, your 9,000. <laughs> Cause you said you got back 9,000 as a tax rebate. If I divide that by 0 0.05, and I'm glad you use 5% because that's probably a good investment that most people would, would do. That's $180,000 you would have to have. And you and you just got that just by letting the government reimburse you your expenses. That's powerful. I'm glad you brought that up, Jason. That's why you the man, man. I salute you. <laughs> I appreciate you. And uh, man, you you just got to want your money. <laughs> you just, I don't know what else to say, Turn. You just you just got to want your money. How can you not want your own money? But, hey, let me let me close this on out. Let me close this on out because I'm going to tell you, this is what this pay look like. Now, this is actually uh, Brian Bean's actual, actual pay stub, okay? Uh, as you can see, uh, one day he got $3,260. That day, uh, six thousand seven hundred seventy dollars one day, eleven thousand four hundred and 